still talks about that. He still comes into training and tells us. I don't actually remember watching this game, but I can remember this year being huge for, for English rugby. That day was a magical day of rugby. You know, you saw teams play some super attacking rugby as good as you've seen in the world. Though we didn't kind of win the tournament, I think we left Twickenham with our heads held high knowing we gave it a, a pretty good crack. Les médias font en sorte de, de, de créer une, une rivalité encore plus importante entre l'Angleterre et la France. Euh, donc du coup, euh, on, euh, le, le plaisir est, 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 est décuplé. To see the two Burgermaske brothers flying through, one chasing the other. I'm sure they did that when they were kids as well. Have a look, please, Jeff. When you go upstairs, the subjective opinion of somebody, of one person, can decide the elation or the defeat. I can confirm the try. Thank you very much, try score. I remember the, the crowd, the supporters, 70,000 people uh, cheering and be supporting us. It's, it's awesome. <laughs> That was an incredible tackle. For all money, they looked like they were going to score, and, uh, and they stopped them. It's uh, big moments uh, in big games. It's handy to have, a, have someone who does that. And so that was, um, that was a surefire try. And uh, what he does, he times his run really well, gets a good wrap and takes him into touch. So great last defender, good example for any, any young aspiring player. Those guys are role models, and it's always nice and inspirational to see that type of thing as well. that moment, uh, well, Scotland were down to 13 men and uh, obviously there's only three minutes left on the clock. Yeah, it's, it's one of the, the rare situations you, you want to be able to experience but you don't actually want to, to be there if that makes sense. It's just one, uh, a wonderful memory uh, because ultimately in a Six Nations game when we didn't start well, to actually win a game in the last touch of the ball and the minute of the game, it was a fantastic uh, win for us. I remember Rog looking up at the clock and running back because he knew that possibly uh, Wales were still going to have another chance and they did get another chance. I think Stephen Jones actually got a, a shot of goal at the end. Look, I think he's probably hit better drop goals in his life, but he's probably hit none more important. And luckily with the couple of minutes left, we were able to hold on and, and get the first Grand Slam in, what was it, 50, 61 years? Yeah, 61 years.